Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to episode number four of Chrono Trigger Let's Play. And let me just start things off right now by apologizing for what happened to uh, episode two and three. I have no idea what happened with the audio recording, but you could not hear a word I was saying. I hope that wasn't too annoying. Um, yeah, all I just say, in order to move on the story, we need to head over to Aerostone. But instead, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be going to the sewer axis here. The monsters are going to be a little bit tougher. That's for sure. But we're going to be picking up a new epic sword for Chrono here. And generally what's going to happen... Ooh, Marl is close to death. As these guys are a lot tougher. A lot tougher than the foes we've seen before. So generally when you play... You realize that and you're like, you know what, screw this, we're not going through these sewers. Let's check out the Aeros Dome like we should have and then move on with this story. But I am going to push on through, make it to the part where Chrono Sword is and then backtrack on out of here. Such a shame that the Fire World doesn't reach all the way around. But that looks good. So yeah, last, uh, last two episodes, audio recording. I'm not really sure what happened there. I think... What I think happened is that my Windows volume mixer just put the volume of the SNES all the way back to 100% because my microphone settings have not changed. So, um, yeah, I guess the last two episodes, I'm recording this all in one big bunch. <laughs> Thank God I checked the footage halfway through after making the last episode. But, uh, yeah, don't know what's happening. So I hope that it wasn't all too quiet for y'all, that I was able to, uh, or that you were able to hear some of the things I was blabbering on about. There's a bridge here. There's nothing here. But all in all, I mean, the epicness of this game is the game and its music, so the fact that you could not hear my voice, uh, probably not such a bad thing after all, huh? Da -da. Let's go around. Nope, can't go around. Looks like we have to go down. What? Yeah, 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 I've got a bad feeling about this, too. Now, here, check any of these items out of curiosity, and it will trigger a battle. Talk to the cat, kick the can, read the note. Maybe not read the note. I think the note was all right. But any of these things will trigger a battle, even the save point. Don't touch the save point. There we go. Um, is this an avoidable battle? Nope. <laughs> Not anymore, it isn't. There we go. Ah, uh, damn it. Let's see. Flame wave. And a slash. And you'll aura yourself. Never mind, no more need to do that. Perfect. Uh, I gotta say, it's, it's kind of hard playing with a d-pad or not without a d-pad i have an xbox 360 kind of accessory controller and for some reason the thing only registers analog stick and not the d-pad on it so playing with an analog stick here on the snes bit weird bit weird especially since navigating through menus even nowadays i still use a d-pad instead of analog stick but uh, you know it's just one of those kind of old school kind of habits that i got going Press the switch and the bridge opens. And you see that chest right next to them? That's where our sword is at. Ribbit. <laughs> Someone's coming. Let's grab. Cool. This battle is going to be a toughie. But I'm going to put on a rage band, which has a 50% counter attack rate. It's pretty epic. Three of them are almost here. Sir Crawley. Hee hee hee. Ha 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 ha. Hee hee hee. Ha 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 ha. Yes, so shit. He's got a massive tongue, huh? I'm sure that's good for some things. Oh, world, yeah. Let's nice attack with Marl. Okay, that did 119 together. Ooh. 
That looks like it hurts. But this... Oh, holy shit. That did 53. Quick, heal her. That was hard. Come on, counterattack. Yes! Nice. There we go. Let's do another flame whirl. Let's heal up Luca. I'll stretch ya. Oh damn. Times of it this is 103 damage. Yeah, told you. <laughs> and this little bastard has a death boss animation. Or a boss death animation. On experience points, should get a level out of that. Yes. Perfect. Alright, now let's heal up. Come on. Alright, there we go. Cool. Moving along. Along the sides. Yes, avoid that battle. And... Bam! Bolt sword! <laughs> Alright, bolt sword. So, if there was a jump in recording, or in the music at least, then that is because I forgot to turn off my team speak, and all of a sudden a massive conversation started. So, uh, yeah, I just jumped out, turned off my team speak, and now I'm back! So, here we are, on the other side of the sewer passage. No idea what's going on here. What's, who is this strange creature? I await your final program code. Mm-hmm. Shala, I've missed you so... No! I have to show you the way. Ocean Palace and the Blackbird. Man, this guy is just going on and on about... Oh, for Christ's sake, Skype. <laughs> there we go. Um... Yeah, <laughs> Skype is also off. Yeah, but this guy's just blabbering on and on about random crap. Bloom. Yeah. Whatever. Whatever. We'll just move along. Old senile man. Talking about things that we have no idea about. Ocean Palace, Blackbird, Shala. And I guess he's right. We can't climb Death Peak just yet. They have to show you the way. No idea what he means by that. Here we go. The bridges are back. That frog was not crazy. And let's get that chest. Oops. <laughs> oh well. One slash. A little flame toss with Luca. And we'll probably have to heal that. Yeah. Counterattack. Come on, counterattack again. Yeah! Awesome. Ah, oh, so awesome. Burst a bubble. And he's dead too. Still not? You better be dead now. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Good, 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 good. So now we got a better sword for Chrono. Perfect. Got 600 extra gold. We're ready to move on. Let's see what the heck's going on here. Aristo. Who are you? To the West. What? Joking. But is that special? It's a piece of cake, guys. 
that's gonna bring us some food. Yeah. Well, all right, fine. Uh-oh, I think your husband's dead. That sure does sound pretty bad. Protodome. Lunatic robots. We're lunatic robots in Protodome. Good to know. Stay off of Death Peak. Yeah, we learned that lesson ourselves. Yeah, talk about crackpots. Totally agree. Yeah, but we're still hungry. Dynamite won't budget. See what she's got. Yeah, we got all that. We're good. That's what that guy who walked through the dome used to say. Ah, see, so he crossed the the ruins as well. Let's save beyond the ruins and uh, let's check this out. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, that don't sound good. We plan to. We definitely plan to. Okay. Damn. Whoa, what's this? Okay. If you say so. We haven't been attacked just yet. Hmm. Oh well. Alright. That's a humongous robot to... Fuck. Alright. Let's kill these bits first. Otherwise this thing's got a massive counter-attack thing. It's like this tri-beam that does devastating area of effect damage. So let's get rid of that first. Oh no. Well, it can't counter-attack. Yeah, see, it does counter-attack now, but only with one dude. So we're still okay. See, oof. That hurts. She's gonna get it too. Hmm. Not good. Horror world. Oh, please don't die. Oh, gosh. Because I don't think I have any revives on me, so if she dead, she dead. Let's do another. Aura just for the sake of it. Aura on herself. Let's get rid of that bit. They notice that she's the healer. Uh, let's see, let's see what kind of damage we do. We do 70 alone. And 35. So we got 105 together like that. And if we do the fire wall. Zero. <laughs> okay. Well, that's obvious enough. No fire rolls. Shit. Waste of a turn. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Before the bits revive. That was close. Oof, alright. Let's get rid of him. Die. Is that the counterattack? It was. Oh, damn. Now they counterattack me. Oh, man. This is pretty heavy. It's a good thing we got that better sword. Please let that be the counter-attack. 
Yeah. Oh, I love that rage band. It's so awesome. Okay, okay, come on, let's get it down before he revives him again. I think we got this. Critical hits, critical hits, keep it up, keep up the critical hits. Break down! Yeah, baby. levels up. Perfect. That's the storage? My god. Yeah. Sure does look like it. I don't think so. Catch the rat. Okay. I don't know what he means by that, but oh, there it is. Damn, he's fast. Come on, come on. Almost got- yeah, got it. L and R button and press A. Okay. Let's see what it is. Cool. More battles that can be avoided. You don't need to fight all those battles all the time. So perfect. <laughs> Weird ass sounding robot type things. Aha! The big info center. And now here comes a very DD moment from Dexter's Laboratory. What does this button do? <laughs> 1999 AD. Official record of the day of lights. That doesn't look good. The world actually looks pretty epic there, 1999. We're in the future. No. Let's just take on that big golden red looking thing. Okay. Epic music time. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Proto Dome. Let's go. But how can we be sure that that gate is going to lead us back to where we came from? I mean, we can't go back through the gate that we came from originally. Because that'll just bring us right back to Guardia Castle. And they'll be waiting for us. But still. Either way, we're on our way to stop Lavis. Yeah, we are. Hey guys, what's up? We're back and we're alive. What's what? It's creepy. You guys are creeping me out. <laughs> Where's the food? <laughs> Got one by key. Cool. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, baby. Daddy's dead. Okay, you guys are just gonna say the same thing. Fine. I love this song. See you guys. Good luck with that seed. We'll stay healthy. Ta-ta now. Farewell. Goodbye. Alright, off to lab 32. That's this place. Let's save first. And let's move on. Woohoo! And now get ready to feast your eyes on some of the most epic 3D you've ever seen. Right after this battle. Huh? What? A battle? The man. <laughs> Johnny. No. Oh. Oh well, whatever. I kind of forgotten how to ride, but it's okay. Yeah, look at that. Oh yeah. Come on. There's one really cheap way to win this race that I know of, but for now we're going to try and do it like this. Oh my god! <laughs> I can handle it. Let's do it again. <laughs> Can't believe that just happened. Alright, here we go. Race attempt number two. Come on. This time we're gonna do it freaking right. Yeah. Come on. You ain't got nothing. Yeah. 
There we go. Epic 3D, huh? That was mind-blowing at the time, I gotta tell you. <laughs> We're right like the wind. Cool. Proto Dome. And there we go. These little buggers. Ah, uh, they are so annoying. But they're just as good as dead. And there's four more of them. I don't know, will Flame Will actually do anything? I don't think so. Let's give it a try. Too bad we can't get all four. That would be it. Come on, come on, come on, what? Okay, good. Eh, can't really do anything. I think it does as much as what a normal Cyclone would do. Let's check it out. <laughs> it did less. <laughs> oh well. Learn something every day. Bam. Yeah. Still hungry. And what do we have here? Luca, you do your thing. <laughs> Sound familiar to anyone? Marl, and this is Chrono. If this song reminds you of anything, anything that sounds kind of familiar from the internet, then you may be correct. It does sound si kind of familiar. If you want, YouTube this. YouTube Robo Chrono Trigger Song and Rick Rolled. If I recall right, the two overlap quite, quite epically. But regardless, it's a good song. R six six Y. His name is Robo. Data storage complete. I mean, he didn't really survive, no. And that pretty much sums it up. In five sentences. Tomorrow you gotta stay.
I need my flame whirl. Although, actually, I guess robots, it doesn't seem to be doing any good, does it? <laughs> Alright, so, let's say before we start this reporting... Reporting factory? <laughs> Whatever factory. Before we start on with this factory, let's save that for the next episode. So, we'll call an end for number four here. Start number five, we'll go right into the factory and turn the generator back on so that we can get over to the gate. Looking forward to that one. Hmm. So uh, leave a like if you liked it, and uh, I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Till then.